Hey folks. This is Sarah. Um, this Molly grew on, uh, I think all the platforms anybody cares about. Uh, I'm gonna play Don't Starve while Gabe takes a little nap. Um, I know that, like, Distar <laughs> Don't Starve was super popular, like, I don't know, what, five years ago? Maybe more than that? Um, but I never stopped loving it. So, uh, oh, we've got- no, we're gonna start a new game. We are definitely gonna start a new game. And I'm pretty old school, so I'm definitely gonna play Maxwell. I just never got over how much I love the art style and the kind of exploration gameplay is my favorite kind of gameplay. Say, pal. Hey, you're right, I don't look too good. I'm gonna look worse later, though. Okay, so we're in some kind of forested land. Got my carrot over here. Get out. Oops. I hate it when I do that. Get some grasses and some, just some stickies so we can have a fire later. Get some berries. I'm trying to remember. No, I definitely streamed a little bit during last year's Extra Life. Not very much, just a little bit. And I think I did mostly Mini Metro, of all things. Um, because we were using, um, browser games. I've been on Steam for kind of a long time, and I have... I don't know, a sort of non-traditional preference for gameplay. Hey, Turkey! I can't do anything about you yet. Oh, some flint. Ooh, and grasslands! Grasslands are good because that's where your beefalo are. And I, um, I subscribe to the pretty old school, uh, uh, don't starve monster defense theory of just run around, uh, in the grassland near the beefaloes whenever you're attacked by something. More, there's some more flint. Okay. Alright. So now we should have enough to make an axe. And now we're gonna check on this tree. Very convenient if the beefaloes are right nearby. Oh, there's a wormhole. Plenty of bunnies. A little side path. You can come check that out again if you want to. Oh, and there's a swamp down here. Where does the side path go? Oh, should be some more rocks here, that'd be good. Some gold. Oh, tall birds. Oh man, I'm so not ready for tall birds. Hey guys. Oh crap, am I in dead end? Okay. <laughs> There's more flint. Now I have a pick. Excellent. Let's um, let's chop one more tree though. That'll be enough for tonight. Another flint. Can uh. Hey 
I haven't played this game in about a year. I know there have been a million updates, and I know that, like, most of the dev work is probably going into the co-player version. You have an odd duck, and, like, Gabe can probably attest to this. I don't like to play multiplayer games that much. The first game I ever really got into was Diablo 2, and I, I never, like, apart from a couple of times when some friends wanted to, uh, to set up, like, lands, like, you're all in the same room type lands, uh, like, I never got on, I don't think I even had, like, a Blizzard account or anything. I just went around and adventured on my own and explored maps and tried to assemble rare sets of armor and things. Oh, that's enough of that. Oh, I thought I'd do one more, just for shits. Oh, that's right, I'm not supposed to swear. Gabe prefers I don't swear on stream. Oh, I've already ate it. Almost night time. I'm also in general not like a super avid talker when I play. One of the things that if any of you watch our Minecraft streams, um, probably know that Gabe talks a lot more than I do. It's just not a habit I ever really developed. It's almost night, so let's get a fire going. Sapling. But for what it's worth, I am watching chat, and I I always have more to say when I have someone to talk to. I've been through most of the grassland. I could check out this area here if I wanted to. But I might be better off continuing this way. Yep, stand there, scratch your ear, Maxwell. Alright. Morning time. Start collecting some seeds so eventually I can get a little farm plot going later. And proceed gaily eastward. There's a likelihood that at some point in the future. Oh, no, 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 no. Tall birds and a cemetery, though. A cemetery's nice. At some point in the future, I'll save these seeds and. That sounds no, I'll, I'll come back and uh, harvest all these um, berry bushes that I'm taking advantage of right now. Yep. Yeah. 
is the little end of the world. So the tall birds are up here. I'm gonna follow this coast around and maybe avoid them and still go east. That wormhole. I find wormholes very tempting because I'm like exploration is my favorite part of most games. But uh, the sanity cost is definitely not worth it when I don't have a easy source of yeah, I'm saying that. An easy source of uh, sanity checking. Ooh. Ooh, what kinds of stuff? Look at that. Hey. Thanks for your pickaxe, buddy. Looks like you hardly used it. Oh, you are hungry, aren't you? Alright, well, time to eat some berries. Chomp, chomp, chomp. And both of these carrots. There we go. Let's see. Over to the west there, there was a entrance to a cave, but I actually haven't done much caving. Maybe I'll try that this time. So many rocks, I'm going to have no lack of gold when I want it. The terminus, okay. Some more grass. Chop down a tree, because why not? All the birds are sleeping. Someone's coming after me. Yep. This is going to sound weird, but I had no idea that tall birds went to sleep. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. Other creatures go to sleep at night. I guess that must be some kind of integral theory on how to defeat tall birds and get their eggs, which I guess is a thing you can do. It's not a thing I've ever done. Probably a really boring gamer to watch now that I think about it. I'm like, how can I play by the rules, be nice to everybody, survive for a long time, and not get hurt? <laughs> Which is like not what your average uh, Twitch viewer is probably looking for in their games. We are back in the grassland. We're going to explore the uh, eastern edge of the grassland to see if there's beefaloes here. Ooh, mushroom. I like mushrooms because they're um, renewable. I'm actually not sure how renewable they are. I know that if you don't dig them up, then they re-sprout at some point in the future. At some point in the future. Um, I don't know how far off in the future that is. Okay, so we've explored all of this. Okay. Down here is swamp land, which might have good things in it, but for now we're going to continue up this path. Ooh, 
with these berries. Eating flowers does nothing. Oops. Oh, I it's a tree doing a thing. Good to go. Let's see what we're doing there then. I think there are bees here. Bees are nice to have around. Just this tab, isn't it? Cool. Oh, I always forget that. This isn't Minecraft. Boards? No, stop it. Here's a nice road. Road, where do you go? You're the same road. Okay, great. Let's go north. Evil flowers. Big forest. Yeah, nice pig village. Hey, piggies. Oh, I found the king pig. Excellent. Piggies are also pretty good for um, manures and uh, defeating bad guys. Oh, my kitten. How's it going? The only trouble potentially, I think, is that. Um, I'm sorry, buddy. Is that uh, if anything attacks and it's not during the day, then the pigs will have gone to bed. Sorry, buddy. So I could certainly set up camp near the pigs if I wanted to. Pigs also tend to fight with spiders, and then you get good drops from the infighting, so that's something to keep in mind. Oh, more grassland! I am pro grassland. Grassland on both sides. And in the center. Okay. Okay. Bunny bunny. Oh, that's a walrus camp. I don't know much about walruses, but I know they're not awesome to have around. So, not near there, anyway. Oh, I see spiders over there. Okay. Day three is the earliest that... Um, 
anyone oh hey hey guys all right we've got our beefaloes we can set up camp now this is awesome okay got any good hanging out spots near the beefalo herd it's all just like a vast grassland We got the sea on this side. That's actually kind of nice because assuming that this loops all the way around where the beefalo are, that means that they're not going to like wander horribly away from me, which I've had happen before. I set up camp and then like the beefalo herd just kind of migrates to be much further from me than I wanted them to be. Wow, this is a vast grassland. Holy cow. Wow. I don't really like to camp in the grassland, in part because it's sort of <laughs> an undifferentiated void. Like, I literally just get bored looking at the grass. Um. <laughs> But also there aren't a whole lot of other resources here, so I don't want to be deep in a single biome if I can avoid it. So let's take a look. The beefalo were kind of in here, which is a pretty good location actually. Spiders. That'll be handy later. Uh, as I suspected, the beefalo are due south of the spiders. Currently? Yep, okay. So between this bulb of land here and the spider's nest up here is where the beefaloes are hanging out. Ooh, there's a lot of them too. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, didn't mean to alarm you. Just stealing your poop. And it is kind of a haul. Oh, and this is where the walruses are. Hmm. So what about here-ish? Let's follow the trail south and then cut east as soon as we leave the grassland and see if that's a good spot. It would be nice to build my morning fireplace tonight. Oh, more grassland. This little pocket isn't such a bad spot, though. So I think, yeah, yeah, I can probably cut that. Well, there's, there's a road here I haven't taken yet. Yeah, so that's that's what we'll do. Fire pit. Beautiful. And I'm hungry. I don't have any meat, so I'm just gonna eat what I've got on hand. So, science machine. I kinda wanna use this area for fields, so we're gonna build the science machine over here. Blended. Oh my gosh, everything. Basic farm. I'm gonna put it slightly to the side here. Gonna plant a seed in it. Oops. 
Yeah, I know you're hungry, buddy. Let's chill out for a minute, okay? Eat your last two seeds. Better? Now we definitely gotta get on some traps. I need more grass for that. Fortunately, we're right by a grassland. So that's the first thing we'll do in the morning is go get some more grass. Warning, warning, this video is almost over. Warning, warning, it's time to choose another one. This has gone on far too long, time to wake up and sing along. Warning, warning, this video is over now.